Sayın bayanlar ve baylar, iyi günler, hoş geldiniz. I'm very honored to open the new TN Talk interview round at the Logitrans 2016. I'm uh, Stefan Iskan, I'm a professor of supply chain management and e-business at the German University of Applied Sciences, Ludwigshafen am Rhein. And I welcome Burak Bey from Ford Otto Sun Trucks. Burak Bay TN Talk was established in 2015. It's a new interview format. It's dealing with the latest insights of the Turkish logistics and automotive industry. And we are just continuing it in 2016. And I'm very happy to have you here. Thank you. I'm very happy to be here. And I'm following your interviews as well. Teşekkürler. Tekrar hoş geldiniz. Hoş bulduk. Burak Bay, you are a senior sales manager at Ford Autosan Trucks. Correct. Ford Autosan is the trademark of uh, one of Turkey's leading family holdings, uh, Koch, and uh, the U.S. car maker Ford. Who is giving the pace in this joint venture? <laughs> That's always the question. Uh, I, I can say that it's going in a very good balance uh, for years, for uh, nine decades now. Uh, so uh, we are a publicly traded company, uh, equally shared uh, between uh, Ford and Ford Autosan. So it's going in a very uh, good and balanced way so far. Uh, and we are the pioneering company in Turkey uh, in automotive business and uh, second uh, largest uh, producer. firm producer and second largest company uh, com in, in, uh, among the commercial corporate. I'm quite sure, Burak Bey, that most of the people outside of Turkey do not know that Turkey is uh, the biggest heavy commercial vehicle market in Europe. Turkish forwarders have the most, uh, the biggest and the modernized uh, fleet in entire Europe, and it's the biggest producer market for light commercial vehicle. Yes, that's correct. That's correct. Uh, we produce the uh, light commercial vehicle uh, in Turkey. Mm -hmm. uh, we are the only produ producer uh, of the new transit. Uh, we are the uh, biggest producer of the new transit. We are the only producer uh, of uh, Transit Courier, uh, and uh, we are the hub for the trucks, for design, uh, for production, uh, and for sales. Uh, Burak Bey, one question. How is, in general, actually the mood in the Turkish uh, industry when looking back to Onbesh Temus? How is the mood currently? Yeah. How is it going on? Uh, actually, uh, there are a lot of things uh, going on in both in uh, Turkey uh, and in the world, uh, as uh, you may know. Uh, so, uh, the good side is Turkish market is, uh, has uh, the ability to adapt and to recover. Mm -hmm. So, that's been the same uh, in Turkey now. So, they, uh, maybe uh, people expect a downward trend uh, in Turkey, but when we look at the numbers, for example, our estimations, uh, we are estimating Your the forecast. Uh, yeah, automotive uh, industry forecast, uh, one million vehicles uh, this year as well, and the Ford uh, will uh, sell uh, 115 or 120,000 of these. So that shows uh, that the things are not going very bad as uh, it's uh, anticipated. But Burak Bey, <laughs> frankly speaking, the entire life of Turkish people is just a crisis. So <laughs> we have not to talk about the crisis right now, it's just how to deal and be agile and yeah, flexible right now. Actually, as I said, we know how to deal with the crisis. For sure. That's it's for part sure. of your DNA. Yeah, uh, and uh, now uh, with the hope uh, and the, with the uh, positive uh, perception, uh, the trend is going up. Also, uh, we have uh, governmental incentives and supports, yes. so that also changed the mood as well. What are your plans for 2017? Ah, good question. Uh, I'll start this question uh, with what we have done so far mm -hmm. uh, in trucks business. So we uh, focused on, first of all, the dealer network, then uh, to quality of the vehicles, the product, the new products, the value-added services, uh, the growth in export markets, mm -hmm. and improving our brand image. So we are working in these six uh, topics, six focuses uh, so far. Uh, in 2017, we will also continue focus on these subjects, and we will continue offering quality products 
and we will continue the growth uh, in the Ford truck side uh, of the business. For example, in Turkey, uh, after our focus in these subjects, our market share uh, increased from 20% 20. to 27.5% in mm -hmm. this part of mm -hmm. the year, and we are planning to uh, close the year in these uh, numbers. So it was a successful uh, history for us, a near history uh, for us so far. We have brand new uh, facilities, the f which we call 4S facilities mm -hmm. uh, in our uh, mm -hmm. dealership network. Mm -hmm. So all of Turkey is equipped with uh, 4S facilities now. Uh, it's almost 30, uh, 30 facilities. 4S means sales, second hand, uh, spare part, and uh, service. So uh, we are offering a complete, complete solution, a package, a complete package for our customers. That's our pride mm -hmm. so far. Uh, we are focusing on, as I said, brand image and improving the export markets, of course. Burak Bey, by the way, thanks for sharing all your thoughts and information. Please feel free and take <laughs> your time to drink some chai with me yeah, as well. Thank you. Uh, what I like tea, by the way. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Shekerli, for sure. No. No? <laughs> uh, what are, where do you see the key trends in future for the truck industry in a domestic and international perspective when it comes to Ford Auto Sun? Where are the general trends? Where is the truck industry driving ahead? And how is uh, Ford Auto Sun uh, moving? Actually, we can talk about the key trends uh, in the uh, truck industry. Uh, so our aim is, the, is competing on these key trends which are uh, actually technology. Technology, telematics. Telematics, uh, total cost of ownership. Mm -hmm. uh, and the Some maintenance issues. Yeah, maintenance and the uh, comfort of the uh, driver, of course. So uh, we also uh, apply tailor-made solutions mm -hmm. for every market that we serve and that mm -hmm. we sell vehicles. So we have different solutions on cabs, on packages, Mm -hmm. on transmissions mm -hmm. uh, and on every aspect that you can think of. Uh, we are concentrated on Turkey as well as the neighborhood and the export markets. Uh, we are opening new facilities in uh, Russia, Eastern Europe, Stans, Africa, Middle East, and the external dealer network is becoming uh, 20 count 22 countries at the end of 2016. Which means that also the Russian factory will be supplied from the Turkish bases. Yes. In future. Yes, that's I think. Uh, CKD, SKD. Yeah, or? SKD. So uh, that's same as well going. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, and we are planning to grow up to 50 countries by 2020, mm -hmm. with over 100 facilities in these countries in the export markets. So we would like to reach. So it's a growth All plan. the customers worldwide. Contribution <laughs> As you to can Turkey's see, yeah. economy. <laughs> yeah. uh, Ford Autosan is launching its new uh, superior model, 1848. Yeah. What can your customer expect in future from this model? What's special? Where is it produced, by the way? <laughs> uh, it's, it's totally produced in Turkey, mm -hmm. as well as all the lineup, mm -hmm. uh, all the truck lineup. Uh, it's 100% Turkish uh, production. So it's produced in Eskişehir, uh -huh. a nice, beautiful city of uh, Turkey. Without international in a, airport. In any plan, yeah. <laughs> but it's a city. But for we have a university. close one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so uh, that's indeed uh, a special vehicle with 13 liter EcoTorque engine, which we are very, very proud of because the EcoTorque engine is also a hundred percent Turkish. Uh, design and production. Mm -hmm. It's again produced in in a plant in Eskişehir, Great. as well as the truck. So we have 480 PS power, which will make our drivers very powerful on long haulage. Uh, we have a lane departure warning system. Will there be any E version, uh, or, or just fuel and gas? Uh, just now, it's uh, gas, fuel and gas. In the first step. But of course, uh, there are some studies 
uh, the future studies. Mm -hmm. So, but now it's a uh, secret in your research, uh, research yeah, department. Yeah, for now, it's 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 gas. Uh, so we have lane departure warning system, advanced emergency brake system, mm -hmm. ESP for our drivers and for our company's uh, customers' safety. Uh, we have an engine brake which we have in introduced uh, standard on this vehicle. Mm -hmm. That's 400 uh, kilowatts, and we offer optional. Uh, an intarder, and with the intarder and with the standard en engine brake, the total uh, braking power goes to 1,000 kilowatts. Burak Bey, by the way, you mentioned Eskishi here as a cluster for production. We should mention for our friends who are not joining Logitrans but watching the record afterwards that Eskishi here is a university city, yes. has a high degree of academic people, You're right. well speaking in Turkish, English as well, and decisive, very well um, developed industry infrastructure. That's, and from that's a right. cost perspective, more attractive than the Istanbul area, right? Yeah, that's, that's, that's correct. Uh, and apart from all, it's a very beautiful city. Definitely. Uh, with there's a, a tram line. With, yeah, with, there is a tram line. There is a river going uh, just uh, in the center of the city. So uh -huh. it's a very nice city as well, apart from all these. All but right. you know it share very well, I, I must uh, confess. A little <laughs> bit, a little bit. So now let's move ahead from the micro perspective of Eskishi here. Now let's go and take a global perspective on the truck industry again. Yeah. If we watch and observe the truck industry, then we can see that uh, all the major brands like Volkswagen Group, like Daimler, uh, it seems that there is a, let's say, a battle, a battle of uh, superiorship in the truck industry. Yeah. What is the role of Ford in that game and Ford Autosan especially? Uh, our goal is to compete uh, with every brand uh, that are in truck business with uh, advanced technology, with quality, uh, with modern design, of course, that's also very important, mm -hmm. uh, with durable and comfortable vehicles, mm -hmm. these are for drivers, and most important, with rational uh, price positioning. Uh, but uh, the thing is, after sales, of course. Our, our job doesn't finish when, uh, when we sell the vehicle. Mm. So it starts with the after sales. So you are measured at the gross profit rate, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, the after sales network uh, is very important for our customers. Mm -hmm. And the after sales service, uh, as a former after sales manager, both uh, responsible of Turkish and export markets, I must say that uh, the sales starts with after sales. So mm. uh, we also aim to give the best service in the after sales and to uh, maintain uh, the best dealer network in the after sales business. Of course, we will continue to produce tailor-made vehicles mm -hmm. For example, municipality vehicles are mm. uh, very important in all the uh, countries and all the big cities right now. So we also uh, do tailor-made production Great. for the municipality. Uh, and uh, our aim again, as I said, is to grow in Turkish market, and but uh, with the uh, help of, with the growth of the export markets. So our you are strongly Amy's, confident. Yeah. As a sales you guy, you that. have to be, right? <laughs> <laughs> Burak Bey, let's, uh, let's look ahead. It's um, a decisive year. It's 2023. Yeah. Very decisive uh, for Turkey. Yeah. How will Ford Autosan truck look like in this year? What will be the position? What do you think? Uh, Quite futuristic, right? Yeah. Uh, again, we can say that the trend and the customer demand is uh, two or three items, the basic ones. First, total cost of ownership. Mm -hmm. We would like to have them pay less mm -hmm. with their business mm -hmm. because the business is getting harder and harder and we know that. So we focus on total cost of ownership with our value added services and with our technology improvement, of course. Uh, the Make uh, life of drivers is not easy. We know that as well. So we would like to have uh, our drivers 
drive comfortably and safely. Again, we will use our old production and design power to make them comfortable and safe, actually. Burak Bey, which, which role will autonomous driving play in the truck industry also in Turkey? Uh, of course, it's... Is uh, that a topic right now? Uh, yeah, it's a topic, and it's also uh, in uh, our uh, goals, aims, as well as the, all the truck market right now, uh, mm. maybe all the automotive indust industry, let me say. Uh, in, in North America, it will be launched and be valid on 2025. By Ford? Uh, no, uh, in general, in it's general, a perspective. In, in general. So, uh, in and in Europe, we know that that will be followed as mm -hmm. well, and we are a follower of Europe mm. markets. So, as 2030, uh, 2025 or 2030, inshallah. we will be inshallah uh, seeing these kind of uh, vehicles, of course. Burak Bey, it was great fun. Thanks for joining. Thanks for having you here at uh, TN Talk as the first interview at the Logitrans 2016. I wish you many fruitful uh, discussions and meetings with your business partners here at Logitrans and hope to see you next time. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to be here. You are welcome. To meet you. Hope to see you again. Thank you very we much. We will. Teşekkür ederim. Görüşmek üzere. Teşekkürler. Görüşmek üzere.